So today's video is going to be my February Lip Love unboxing and tutorial. And I always have so much fun doing these videos because if you are like me, if you have a lot of makeup, you kind of get lost in your makeup and whenever I have the opportunity to try new products I get really excited because we all get in this funk that we use the same thing over and over and over again. We all have preferences and whatnot but it's really fun when I get to try new products and I ended up really surprised with this look today. I really love the way it came out. Uh, it's very warm and it's kind of like a halo eye but I promise it's very simple I promise. Uh, you know, I always try to simplify everything for you guys, but I really, really like how it came out. So I hope that you guys enjoy it too. And I'm going to put a timestamp if you would like to skip this unboxing part and just go right to the tutorial. So I will put a timestamp right down here. So I'm going to go in order and follow the card. So first we have the limited edition makeup bag, which is worth $12. I love the bag. It's very, very sturdy. Um, you know, it's you can keep a lot of stuff in here. It's pretty big um, compared to my Ipsy bags and things like that. Uh, and it has a lining inside, so it's pretty awesome. And then we have the lip brush by So Susan that's worth $18. And I use that's why it's dirty. I use it just now, and it's really handy. It's very precise, and it this might be my favorite lip brush that I own so far. Um, I really, really like the way this apply my lipstick today. So this is absolutely amazing. And I love the design. It's purple and gold. You can't go wrong with that. Next, we have the Liquid Matte and Moon Nude. And this is a liquid matte lipstick. And I know what you guys are thinking. This shade is very intimidating. It looks like concealer. I know, I know. But I have this as an ombre on my lip today and I really love it. This can be a very handy kind of lipstick to mix in with something if you want to make a little bit of a, a brighter color or you know take it down a notch. Um, this can be mixed in and just give you a whole nother look. So I love the way this ombre lip turned out. I don't normally do ombre lips but I am really digging this. Next we have the sponge bronzer by Trifle Cosmetics and this is worth $19. I had the privilege of trying this bronzer before and I absolutely love it. That's all I have going on on my cheeks right now. I didn't contour, I didn't add any blush and I love this. And it smells... <sighs> it smells like like a milk chocolate. It smells really good. I really like it. And it's super compact and it also has a mirror on the other side which is very handy as well. And then lastly we have the bonus item which is the Supercharged in Electric by Jelly Pong Pong Cosmetics. And this little guy right here is what I have going on right in the center of my eyelids. And it's super pigmented and I love it. The shimmers are, they remind me of that L'Oreal um, you know, the little L'Oreal eyeshadows, like, they're kind of like cushiony, uh, but the shimmers are beautiful. So I had no trouble apply applying this on my eyelids today. I absolutely love it. So the total for this bag this month is of $86, and you can either buy it separately and pay $45 just to, uh, you know, purchase this specific bag, or you can do a subscription, which is $20.95 every month and these are all full size products that you get every single month and um, if you use my code liplovecarol this time I will be making a small commission so if you don't feel comfortable please don't feel like you have to use that you can just uh, sign up on the link that I will leave it down below for you guys and it's not an affiliate link it has just nothing to do with me so that's all I got in my bag if you're new please don't forget to subscribe and now if you want to see how to create this look and just keep watching. So as you guys can see, I have all my base and my brows all done. Uh, I got this out of the way because I feel like you guys get bored of watching me applying foundation and filling my brows on camera. So now we can move on to the fun part. So for my eyes, I'm going to start by applying Peach Smoothie by Makeup Geek as my transition shade. And you don't have to be precise or neat with this shadow. We're just going to use this to make our life easier for the next shadow that we're going to be applying. So now I'm going to actually take the bronzer that we got in the bag and I'm going to put that in my crease. It's a beautiful kind of like a brick brown color and it's going to look perfect 
with this look that I'm going for. This actually kind of matches my little headband today. And then I'm just going to go back with my big fluffy brush and I'm going to blend it all together just to get rid of all the harsh lines. So now I'm going to take the supercharged eyeshadow duo and I'm going to do this gold shade right in the middle, sort of like a halo eye uh, kind of look that I'm going for. So I'm going to just press this with my fingers first just to deposit that pigment. These are highly, highly pigmented. So I'm going to deposit that first with my finger and then I'm going to blend it out with a brush. Now I'm going to take a pencil brush and I'm going to dip onto that bronzer again and I'm going to intensify just the corners, the outer corners and the inner corners just to make sure everything is nice and blended. So I'm going to take this MAC liner and it's in the color Espresso and it's a very dark brown. I'm going to tight line my upper waterline and also my lower lash line. And then with a flat brush, I'm going to pack this on the very root of my lower lash line, kind of like to set that eyeliner. And then I'm going to take that same pencil brush and just blend my lower lash line to get rid of all the harsh lines. So now I'm going to take an even darker brown shadow and this is Makeup Geek Americano and I'm going to intensify that smoke lower lash line with the same pencil brush. Now with a clean fluffy brush I'm going to run this on my lower lash line just to make sure it's well blended. Now I'm going to curl my lashes, apply some mascara and then I'm going to apply some falsies and today I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Luxe Lash Kit in Winged and Bold. Alright, so I went ahead and applied my false lashes and I also applied some mascara to my lower lash line. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet for my inner corner highlight and brow bone highlight. So I'm going to leave my eyes alone for a minute and I'm going to move on to the face. So now I'm going to take that same bronzer and a big fluffy brush and I'm going to apply this to my cheekbones. For my highlighter, I'm going to take my Mary Luminizer from my Luminizer Sisters and I'm going to apply this on the very tops of my cheekbone. So I've seen Mac Daddy, um, Angel Moreno, I've seen him do this trick many, many times and I have been doing it lately because I want my face and my, you know, highlight to be super dewy. So what you do is you take a spray like Fix Plus and then you spritz all over your face and right when it's right about to um, dry, you apply your highlighter. So it's just kind of make everything super glowy and intense. And I love it. And then I'm gonna highlight my cupid's bow and also the bridge of my nose. So for my brow bone and for my inner corners, I'm gonna keep everything matte. So I'm gonna go in with my Makeup Geek Vanilla Bean. So now for the lips, I wanna show you guys what you can do with a nude lipstick like this because I'm not gonna lie, this is very intimidating to me and it feels like it's something that it's really, really too nude in a way. But I'm going to show you guys how you can use something like this to your benefit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix two of these little guys right here. And I love this one. I've used it before in a different look. And I love, love, love it. So I'm going to mix both of them and kind of do like an ombre um, kind of lip look. And I'm also going to be using this super handy lip brush that came in the bag. And then I'm going to wipe my brush and do the same exact thing using the lighter lipstick. And I'm going to concentrate this on the very center of my lips. And then to tie it all together, I'm just going to apply a little bit of gloss to the very center of my lips. Alright guys, so that's it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. And I will be linking and listing everything down for you guys in the description box. And I will also leave a link if you would like to sign up for Lip Love. If you guys have any questions, suggestions, or anything that you would like to say, please leave me a comment down below. You, you know I love to hear what you guys have to say always. I love interacting with you guys and I just... I love this little family that we have going on here. I really, really appreciate you guys. So as always, if you like this video, if you found it helpful, and if you learned something new, please give me a thumbs up and share it with your friends because it really, really helps my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.